guys and welcome back office add-ins and today we are specifically going to talk about PowerPoint add-ins and I am introducing here iSlide a tool and add-in for Microsoft PowerPoint which will enable you to create professional PowerPoint presentation even if you are not a professional designer so what are PowerPoint PowerPoint add-ins. So Office add-ins basically can help you to personalize your presentations or speed up the way you access information on the web and then create professionally uh, some, some uh, templates, some models that you really think can be helpful in presenting your data or information. So while talking about iSlide, it has built in 180,000 plus uh, PowerPoint templates, which are continuously updated. You can quickly search them and with one click, you can insert them. On top of that, there are attractive PowerPoint diagrams with various uh, parametric adjustments. iSlide Smart Design Diagram makes data initiatives intuitive and easy to understand them. Uh, there are three steps design in the PowerPoint, select the theme, insert the icon and add text. It's very simple and customized slides by combining various library sources. I will show you through different sources today with a quick example. So let's go through and use some of the areas where I believe you should understand and you should use them more professionally by having clicked on that. At the end of the presentation, I will also share with you the link in below comments. You can see the link uh, which can help you to get free coupon guys. This is a good news for you. So you can enjoy this tool for a free months on top of your subscriptions. So let's go and see some of the techniques and abilities that uh, PowerPoint add-in uh, iSlide has and how it works for you. I will take you through, uh, for example, let's say I would like to add an image here. So I will add one image and on this image, I'm going to perform some activities. So let's see how I can perform some activities using iSlide. So one of the activities that I can see here, for example, uh, cropping. So circular cropping, I can use this tool to circular crop this. I will make like, let's say a small count, five of them. Uh, space, I can adjust it here and make it from center. Apply, the moment I apply, you can see that uh, the shape has been cut into multiple circles and then I can use it for my presentation very easy and handy did you realize guys how quick it was to remove or add images here you can add smart diagrams from the menu from my slide menu once you have installed login you can use the smart diagrams from there so for example I clicked on and there's a huge library containing hundreds of uh, and thousands of resources here so you can use any one of them that is suitable for your particular presentation so for example if I take this one here it's downloading so I have to be patient and the moment it's downloaded I can see the chart down there this is the smart diagram that I can use for my own presentation so if I have to change or edit the content I have to simply right click on the chart and you can see at the bottom edit smart diagram I can click on it and here you go now I have the names of the series so I can kind of a change the names here on the text but I can change the values from here for example with every move that I make here you can see the values are changing I can increase this one I can decrease this one and I can increase this one as well so you can see how I could easily uh, change uh, the values of these uh, kind of uh, components that I had I can change the colors from here as well for example this is the one I've changed and that is the one I've changed as well and there you go so I can play a lot with the multiple comments here. Now I would like to text edit here so I can say water and I can say milk and other resources, etc, etc. So this is just an example how you can add multiple smart diagrams and you can also see that there are other multiple examples as well that you can utilize as and when required for your presentations. You can also use diagram library here. It contains a lot of diagrams, thousands of diagrams that you can use for your presentation. And these are much more different and advanced and technically designed for your needs. So you can choose any one of them and edit it as 
and when required. So I'm just putting in an example here. There are thousands in this diagram library, honestly. I cannot share all of those with you, but you can see one of them here. So I can amend and change this as and when I need, for example, another one I would like to go and insert from the diagram library. You can search here and uh, choose whatever you like. For example, I choose this one, a globe kind of uh, initiative I want to share with my team. So I'll close this and I'll see what do I have. Here you go. So these are some extraordinary diagrams that you have in your PowerPoint. On top of that, there is another section that is called theme library. So you can click on it and you can find hundreds and thousands of uh, themes here as well that you can utilize for your PowerPoint presentations, which are not really available if you see in the normal PowerPoint presentation templates that you have uh, available. Just be patient for the tool to download it and then you can see massive amount of creativity for your presentations. Use it. Enjoy this, guys. You can also convert your PowerPoints into videos using this iSlide tool. So, for example, I will add a small animation here. I will go to the icons. You can also convert and export your videos to you can also convert and export your presentations into videos and that is one of another handy features that I believe it's it's good to have in, in a PowerPoint add-in to get me able to do that. So for example, I will add an icon here from the icon library. Um, let's say I use uh, this plane as an icon to be built in from the library. I'm just being patient because it's downloading online from the library and bringing it into my PowerPoint presentation, which was not available already for me in my PowerPoint template. So I can see my plane is here, which is uh, very beautiful. I will, I can, I can change the facts and colors of uh, this shape. For example, if I want to give it a green or some other color, I can do that. So for example, I've given it a green color. Now I will animate it. For example, I can give any uh, sort of animation uh, to this, for example, uh, sequence. So I can give any sort of animation to this. For example, I will add an animation uh, for giving it an effect, a motion path. So I will give it a circular, not really. I will get a square motion path, which is taking it up. I will select OK, and I will bring it up here. Now this has an a path that can be used. I will go to the ISLI library and will export it as a video. So it's asking me what should be the resolution. I want to customize the resolution as well, quality as well, and everything else. I'll just simply export it to my desktop, presentation1.mp4. Just being patient, it's been exported uh, as a PowerPoint uh, video. You can see down here, it's been exported to MP4 version and the bottom and it will shortly be displayed to you once it is completed. So let's have a look. Once it's completed, so it's downloading. It's almost done, almost done. And there we go, it's completed. I will run uh, this into uh, the screen. Just give me a second, I'll double click on it. There it goes, I will Pause it here and I will bring it to you guys. So this is the video that has uh, been exported. I will take it from the start. So it took the first slide as well as part of my video as per the transition. And now after the transition, you can see the plane is there. It's moving on to its path. So this is a video that you can convert using this tool in, in minutes, in seconds. On top of that, there, there are a lot of uh, pictures in the library here. In the picture library, you can go and you can find thousands of images for your usage. So you can pick up anything and bring it into your PowerPoint. You don't have to go out of PowerPoint while you're working. Everything will be available and brought into for you through this tool. You can see here the, the item is available. Also, there is an icon library. You can use that icon library as well, and you will find hundreds of uh, thousands of icons that can be utilized for your presentations. And I think this is one of the most beautiful part of this tool that you have a freedom and liberty of bringing in as many as icons you need. So this is another handy and beautiful feature of this tool. As I mentioned, guys, in the description of this video, you will find a 
code coupon code that coupon code will extend your uh, subscription to 90 days so you will get extra 90 days and you will get uh, this discount so today if you go to the tool go to the link you will get an early bird discount on top of that you will get this extension discount as well so i will encourage you to go and use this tool enjoy this tool and do share your feedback in the comments area which will be very helpful for the team uh iSlide team to take as their uh, updates for their corrections and if you have any good ideas please do share here in the link and i will forward it through to the team Thank you very much, guys, for joining in again, and I wish you all the best in your PowerPoint presentations. Looking forward to speak to you again. Bye-bye.